In the world of solar water pumping, there are four main types of pump ends used. There's diaphragm, piston, helical rotor, and centrifugal. This is Mike with RPS Solar Pumps, and today I'm gonna to walk you through helical style pumps and centrifugal pumps. We believe these are superior to both the diaphragm and piston pumps in terms of longevity and being able to field repair them. The solar pump has two main components, the motor and the pump end. All of our motors here at RPS are brushless DC motors. That's gonna give us the longest lifetime and it's not gonna be a limiting factor on the life of your system. We have two main styles of pump ends. On my right here, we have a centrifugal pump end, which has spinning discs inside, basically propellers that accelerate the water outward and upward building pressure. On my left here, we have helical style pumps. These are positive displacements. This is like a worm gear inside of a rubber stator. Every time that worm gear rotates, it positively displaces water up and out of the well. In this video, I'm gonna go through the benefits and the pros and cons of each style. Let's go over centrifugal style pump ends. On the right, you can see a whole variety of different styles of centrifugal pumps. What they all feature are stacked impellers in order to accelerate the water outward and upward, building up pressure. Here we can see if we remove the bottom off our stacked impellers, the bottom is our impeller and you can see it spins. And what that does is builds up a little pressure, passes the water to the next stage. The next stage builds up a little bit more pressure and continues to build up that pressure until it exits the pump end and is able to overcome the static water level in your well. The benefits of a centrifugal style pump end are higher volume, but usually lower pumping heads when we're talking about solar pumps. One of the benefits is they're much better at handling sand and other debris in your well. Centrifugal pumps are better for higher volume, lower pumping head applications. There's no wear parts, and they're better at handling sand than a helical pump. They tend to use slightly higher power, so in our case at RPS Solar Pumps, there's no two panel option. We only have the RPS 400V and 800V, which are four panels, 400 watts, and eight panels, 800 watts. The most common usage for centrifugal solar pumps are shallow wells, pumping out of ponds, or other surface water sources. Helical rotors, on the other hand, are better for higher pumping heads at lower volumes. Features a rubber stator with a stainless steel screw gear that goes inside. As the motor turns this gear, it's gonna positively displace water up and out of our pump end. These are perfect for replacing windmills. With only from 200 to 800 watts of solar, we're able to pump up to around 325 feet of pumping head. That's much higher than we can achieve with an equivalent centrifugal pump. If your application is pumping high pumping head and you only need anywhere from two to eight gallons per minute, then a helical rotor is probably the right choice for you. One downside is they are susceptible to damage by sand and other debris inside your well. But the good news is, all of our pumping mechanisms are user replaceable. So if it ever wears out in the field, you're able to replace it and it'll be pumping as good as the day you first put it in. So how do you decide between a centrifugal style pump or your helical style pump? If you're pumping out of a shallow well, a lake, a pond, and your pumping head is less than 100 feet, then centrifugal is a great option for you. Also, if you have a degraded well where you're getting sand intrusion or you have the red clay in it, then you also want to try to go with a centrifugal style pump. Otherwise, we can wear out our helical rotors rather quickly. Now, if you have a higher pumping head out of a clean well, then helical is a great option for you. With only two panels, we can pump around 100 feet of pumping head at three gallons per minute. As we go past 100 feet of pumping head, if we go up to our eight panel kit, we can do around 350 feet at a couple of gallons a minute with only 800 watts of solar. So that's a quick overview of centrifugal versus helical style pumps. Like I said at the beginning, we think these are superior to other solar pumps on the market that either use diaphragms and wear out very quickly or use pistons, which the piston can easily be damaged by any sand or other debris inside of the well. Now don't worry if you're still not sure which style of pump end you should go with. If you give us a call, we have pump specialists standing by in order to evaluate your exact pumping application and recommend the right pump for you. This is Mike with RPS Solar Pumps and give us a call at 888-637-4493 to figure out which pump end is right for you.